Hey guys, so this is gonna be a surprise series that I'm gonna be throwing right out there. Cyberpunk Edge Runners, I have heard, is phenomenal. I was thinking about, you know, just watching it by myself and just binging it, but I was like, no, this is gonna be good. This is a good thing to do. I really like the style of Cyberpunk. When the game originally came out, I wanted to play it so, so bad because I'm obsessed with the style. The music is fire. I wanna watch a show surrounding that especially one that's good. If you're new to the channel, thank you so incredibly much for taking a chance and clicking on this video. I appreciate it so much. And if by the end of the video you like it and are interested in seeing more, the link to my Patreon will be down below in the description. There I post my full length commentary on everything as long as my as well as my full length reviews. So that will also be an option. So thank you guys again and let's get right into the show. Are you guys prepared? I'm really ready. I'm so ready to watch this. I'm very excited. You guys ready? Three, two, one, go. I just pray that the music is as good as it is in the game. <sighs> I really can't wait. I cannot wait. I'm very excited. Okay, okay. I haven't seen the trailer. I haven't seen any recap. I have no idea. I'm completely blind going in. I, I just... Oh, oh, this better be good. If you hate your wife, why did you marry her? <laughs> no, but you are- Oh, that's a lot of blood. That's like a lot of blood. <laughs> He's bulletproof? Can we talk about the Santa beard and the rat tail? <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so this- this show has gore. I- I'm going in blind. Oh, there's gore. So it's like a Deus Ex sort of situation. I never asked for this. Oh, they're so gonna. Oh my god, they are gonna blow him up. In these situations, he, they always survive. Oh, maybe not. No, no, he'll be fine. He's gonna like blow up. Oh, yep, it was a. This is like a game right now. Oh my gosh. Okay, so the show is just like gory, not safe for work, everything. Got it. Now you gotta hand wash everything. So Wait, so that was real? I thought that was a VR game. Alright, music's okay so far. <laughs> This is pretty cool. This is really dope so far. He smiles at the blood splatter. Is this normal? I like her hair so far. That's a main character though. Meditation class? That would actually be pretty cool. Yikes. This is no parent wants to hear that. Oh no. I really like the voice acting so far. What? No, 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 no. No, no, 
it's not. No, it's not. Whoa, 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 what? Just because they're not policy holders? Because they're not subscribed? So they can't get medical care? That's gonna cost so much. So they didn't have insurance because they can't afford it. Hmm. Relatable. Everything's automated. There's never any there's no way really around stuff. He's gonna have to get to work. He's not going to school after this. He's gonna have to get to work. So they get stuff installed in them or their heads. I don't even know. No, that's definitely it. Cracks my crown. Bro, look who's talking. Look in the mirror. How would he even know? Is the principal a snitch? She should kill him. Give him a haircut too. His hair is horrible. I'm convinced this man is blind. Never seen a mirror before. Yeah, Bro, his hair. I can't handle his haircut. <laughs> Why does he remind me of Cusco? Like the smugness, the chin, the hair, Cusco, but like a bad version. Okay, actually I'm surprised, but like people who run their mouth usually cannot back it up, so I'm... I'd say I'm impressed, but he didn't learn it. It's chip, never mind. <laughs> I didn't deserve this treatment, that's so sad. Are you choking? It's all about money. Poor people don't have a choice. People who struggle. It's like the system is just trying to rob everyone. That's how society is pretty much going, too. <laughs> It's terrible. Oh, it's this guy. Oh, he's gonna kill him, isn't he? He's still gonna kill him. Okay, that seems so promising. I'm excited. Oh my god, I'm excited. I'm I'm thrilled about the next episode. Okay. So I just finished watching the first episode of Cyberpunk Edge Runners, and I have to say it is super sad. So far, the story essentially follows this dude. I believe his name is David. He lives with his mom. Uh, his mom was <laughs> was a law enforcer, so a police officer, I assume. She had passed away, um, and the reason why she couldn't get proper medical care is because they didn't have enough money. And it seems that this entire world revolves around how much money you have. It's kind of scary how parallel it is to the world today. Mm, you know, this being in 2077 is not too far off, and that kind of freaks me out a little bit, you know? Personally, I'm also kind of having the same thing where I need to figure out my health insurance and it's terrifying. I have a lot of health issues and due to that stuff, I have asthma, I have to take asthma and like lung medicine. Even with insurance, it costs me almost like $100 just to be able to stay alive and that's with insurance. So without insurance, it's like impossible to be alive. So I understand. It is really important to kind of realize those parallels and it's sad. It is really upsetting and this is like a young dude. He's in high school, you know, you see that he's finally broke, he had enough and he is going to 
do something about it. He's not gonna let people walk all over him anymore. So I think it's gonna get pretty emotional. And I, it looks very promising. So I really do like the show so far and I cannot wait to get into episode two. Are you guys ready? Three, two, one, go. You should kill him. You should definitely kill him. Ew! That's gross. Rip it off. That guy's gross. They don't numb him? Uh, his mom wouldn't like this very much. David First boss battle? Love that for him! You're trash. Love that. I love his attitude. Don't care. <laughs> yeah, he was just rubbing it in your face because it's hilarious. That's horrible. Now worth it. I was gonna wonder when he was gonna shower. He needs to. He had so much blood on him. How is he not in more mourning? I don't think I'd survive if, my, if anything happened to my mom ever. He's thinking the same? Never mind. He just likes to jump into trash. Respectable hobby. Ew! Ew, now I know what that thing is. That's disgusting. I'm throwing up in my mouth. Who do you think you are stealing people's stuff? I say boyo, okay? Stealing stuff now, are we? At least port, port, go for 6040. David. So, what exactly are they stealing? It's not going to affect their brains. Oh, that sucks. She's crazy. I like her. The art is so nice. She's awesome. I love her. I love her. He's just gonna be on that machine being disgusting. He sucks. That's it? She gives me Faye Valentine vibes. The music is nice. I really like the music. I love the vibe of this show so much. Her place is dope. Kanpai. <laughs> She's a bad influence. Mars? 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 
こんな奴らに馴染めるわけないってアカデミーに行ってあんた人の夢のために生きてるの These visuals are stunning. 夢は他人のものじゃないわ私にとってはここが地獄いいもの見せてあげる Are they tripping out? What's happening? おーすげえ改造だ人が感じて大丈夫なくらいにはセーブしてるわオフにする何その格好マーズ・アロン I'm in love with this show so far The music is so good Everything is so good 誰かとやるのなんで見せてくれたのいいコンビになりそうじゃないレジを超えちまったな<笑>もう。You know, story building, kind of building his relationship with,、uh, what was her name? Lucy. Yeah. So it's kind of like that, and him starting to kind of get up on his own feet. But a big theme by the end of the episode was they kind of were talking about their dreams and how Lucy's dream is to kind of just get away. And she finally showed David kind of like the ex some experience. And I don't know, it made me very emotional. And I understand that. Of course, they have it much. Much harder, but in today's standards, it's, it's rough right now, you know. A lot of people are sacrificing what they want to do in their loves just to be able to survive, to scrounge together enough money to be able to live, and so a lot of people just want to escape. You know, I'm kind of in a low rut right now where I'm not where I want to be, and so I kind of get that mentality. I'm getting a little emotional, but it's hard, so I kind of get that. And then seeing their montage of them being happy, it's kind of like, oh, maybe you know, it'll be good for everyone. Maybe I'll also be happier too, you know? It was, it was uplifting. And then that all came crashing down because she set him up. And that is so upsetting. She was very promising. <sighs> But I guess she's an enemy. Maybe not. I don't know. But I gotta say, the visuals, stunning. The style, amazing. The music, the music is good. I'm loving the show so far. And I cannot wait to watch the next episodes. I'm very excited. And I hope you guys are too. Sorry for the rambling. I hope, hope, hope you guys enjoy. Thank you so much. Bye bye. Oh